If you own a compatible PC or Mac, you don't have to buy a Rodecaster Pro 2. With one small caveat. And yes, Rode gives you their blessing to use their free Rode Connect software. You can connect up to four guests using Rode's compatible microphones and interfaces, and then mix, process, record, and stream your audio. Here's a list of compatible Rode devices. The AI Micro, the NT-USB Mini, the NT-USB Plus, NT-1 5th Generation, PodMic USB, VideoMic Go 2, VideoMic NTG, Wireless Me, Wireless Go 2, Wireless Pro. And like I said, you can connect up to four compatible microphones to the same computer or Mac and still have access to Rode's powerful processing. Rode Connect boasts a fully featured recording interface complete with broadcast style faders, level metering, mute buttons, and more. Plus, you get virtual channels for seamlessly connecting remote guests, integrating streaming applications, adding music beds, and much more. You also have an automatic mix minus on every channel, ensuring echo-free recording. And of course, Rode sound pad section with three playback styles and eight banks of sounds. If that wasn't enough, you also have multi-track recording. The virtual channel is for connecting with remote guests via Zoom, Skype, and other services like that. While the system channel is to bring in audio from your computer and it could come from any app on your computer. Think loop back. While Road Connect is definitely worth being excited over, it might not be for everyone. I've been using it on a business computer that I purchased secondhand just because it's a lot quieter than my gaming PC, and it's using roughly 6 to 9% of the CPU. But if you have a very underpowered computer, it might not work well for you. Also, it's one more app you have to keep an eye on where you may just prefer to use hardware. And lastly, you're going to have to keep all the routing straight. So let's say you don't want to use Road Connect and you want to use an interface. Now you got to go back into these various applications and make sure the routing is correct for them. But if I were a live streamer or podcaster who didn't already own a Roadcaster Pro 2 or a Roadcaster Duo, I would probably give Road Connect a shot and just see how it works out for my productions. And of course, the most important thing is, how does it sound? Well, you've been listening to me using Rode Connect on my secondary PC for the entirety of this video. How do you think it sounds? Now I'm on the Rodecaster Duo with the exact same settings. How does it sound in comparison to the Rode Connect setup on my secondary PC? Chime in in the comments down below. As always, thank you.